Apple just exposed the biggest lie in AI with the illusion of thinking, proving that reasoning models like Claude, DeepSeek R1, and OpenAI's O3 Mini don't actually think. Instead of recycled math problems, Apple created brand new puzzles these models had never seen. The results were shocking. For simple problems, standard AI models outperformed expensive reasoning models while using fewer resources. For medium complexity, reasoning models showed some advantage, but for high complexity problems that mirror real world scenarios, both types collapsed to 0% accuracy. Yeah, okay, it's very important to preface that in the race for AI supremacy, and we know that AI is basically going to dominate the future economy, going to be worth trillions of dollars, whoever conquers, especially AGI first. And we discussed in a previous episode the differences between AGI and artificial general intelligence and artificial super intelligence, etc. But Apple is nowhere in the race. They're one of the greatest tech companies in the world, but they're not even in the race. The race is between Claude and ChatGPT, OpenAI, and Microsoft, which is, uh, controls ChatGPT, and Google with Gemini, and uh, now Grok, right? There, it's basically a four-player race. Apple isn't even in the arena. They partnered with ChatGPT but to help the them. Point, but they're not, saying, they're not saying they're better or that they got a better... I understand. It's just... An, not at all preface. saying that. It's, it's important they're to They're just understand. saying... I understand that you could say... The argument could be, since they're not in the game, they're going to try to disparage the ones that are. Is that what you're saying? Not necessarily disparage, but I'm just saying they they did they put these systems to a test and they all failed. And the conclusion they reached, which again you can dispute and say it's not true, but what I take from that is there's some question I don't as to it. whether or not there's real thinking going on. And I also agree that not at this point. And but there's the mimicry, there's the illusion of a magic trick, okay, that humans can be tricked into believing things. In fact, there's some stories I came across, which we're not going to include today, but there's people now on social media that say they are having relationships with yeah. another convinced. It's become yeah. a thing all over TikTok that they are now like in a relationship with an AI and the AI understands them better than anyone else. And you could say have a relationship with a pet parrot, but it's not an equivalent to a human being. What do you think? Be sure to watch our other shorts and clips and the entire episode 17 of the Yojo Show podcast.